I sat straight up from a dead sleep. I slowly removed the covers and put my feet on the floor getting off the couch. I was awake, but I didn't seem in control. For some unknown reason, I was drawn to the front door. My grandmother was sound asleep on the other couch across the room as I walked to the living room to the front door. Unlocking it, I slowly turned the doorknob and opened it. There it was, before me. This thing, a black mass looked up at me. The only thing separating us was three concrete steps. It stood there, staring at me, and I stared at it. It's like I couldn't look away. My eyes were locked on the blackness where the creature's eyes should have been. There was no life in them, no heartbeat, breath, or soul. I was face to face with true evil. Imagine walking into a pitch black room to where you couldn't see your hand in front of your face. You would still see him. He was darker than dark. He wouldn't be consumed by the darkness. He was the darkness. But I wasn't afraid. I could have shut the door any time and woke up my grandmother, but I stood there, willingly, staring at a darkness that seemed to consume everything around me. I was being brainwashed, unable to blink or control my own actions. I seemed lost in time once again. Everything around me seemed to stop just so I could experience this moment. I don't know why I did the following. The next words that I spoke would haunt me for years to come, voluntarily giving it a name, allowing it into my life and my home. Hi, Shinobi, I smiled. My childhood obsession of ninjas coming out at the absolute wrong time. I didn't see it as a threat in the moment. I literally identified it as something that I was a fan of on the cartoons that I watched and the movies that I admired. Little did I know that after I shut that door and went back to sleep, my life would never be the same.